Welcome back to Cooking with Your Agent. We are bringing a special treat to you today, both by food and this amazing home up off of Eagle Ridge. It's just right outside, about 15 minutes up into Forest Hill, right outside of Auburn. Excited to show it to you. It's a stunning property with beautiful RV storage and garage with an amazing backyard. So we're gonna see it. But today, we're gonna to also be cooking shashuka, which normally is kind of a mixture between a, using tomato sauce with egg, but today we're gonna be substituting with kale, which is outstanding and yummy. We're also going to be sharing one of my favorites, which is an avocado toast with some watermelon with some feta cheese. Come in, let's take a look, and let's get cooking. Hey, welcome inside. This is an amazing kitchen, amazing home. I really love how it's open in to the, um, into the living room with a built-in fireplace, and right outside has an indoor-outdoor feel of some great entertaining with your built-in barbecue and fire little fire pit out there. So check out those pictures. So what we've got going here is you want a uh, some type of a oven proof skillet and we've got our three tablespoons of olive oil and a teaspoon of smoked paprika that we have as well and we've got the three cloves of garlic that we're kind of stirring this around you want to have that going little medium heat and you want about a pound of kale and this is going to be cooking down so kind of get that going right here and we're going to add to this as it cooks down and we'll catch you on the other side Hey, welcome back. We've got our kale cooked down here. And so what we're going to go ahead and do now is uh, give it a little bit of salt and pepper. And we are going to put a half a lemon. Get all that lemon juice out of there. And let's give it a little stir. And again, I've turned the heat off at this point, so we're just kind of sitting here in the um, cast iron pan. Then we're gonna go ahead and give a nice generous of some feta cheese. Generous amount here. All right. And so now, if you had little cast iron, little serving Hands. You can put that in there, certainly, if you had a smaller group. Uh, you can find them online for about 10 to $12 a piece. Today, we just have our cast iron pan that we're going to go ahead and put in the oven here in just a few moments. But what you want to do now is you want to kind of open up, depending on how many people you're serving, open up little wells, little whole kind of wells here on the cast iron pan, kind of evenly placed a little bit there for you. And so I'm going to get around five or six out of here. And then you're going to go ahead and crack an egg. You're going to drop that right there into these holes. And we are going to then put this in the oven. And really, you just want to cook this to your eggs of your liking. If you like them over medium, over hard, kind of watch that. So it's ready to go when the eggs are done. So there you go. We're going to go ahead and put that in the oven. We'll talk to you about some uh, other fun things we're going to add to this uh, brunch here today. Hey, while the kale shishuka is cooking there and getting those eggs to your perfection, I wanted to also share a few things that we actually love to use with this brunch. Uh, this is what I call kind of a breakfast kind of mash. It's kind of fun. It's got some... Uh, uh, diced potatoes, you can either buy them pre-seasoned and diced or you just get some roasted potatoes uh, mixed with just some uh, cheddar cheese with some bacon with some wonderful zucchini right on the top and it's delicious with, served with some sour cream and salsa. All right, so here we go with the avocado toast. I love this meal. This is great. You can actually have this straight up for dinner because it's amazing. But what I've got is take any type of bread that you would like. You want know, to toast it a little bit, cut it or to your thickness. You're going to take about a quarter avocado. You're going to kind of want to squish that avocado on the toast here. Spread it all the way to the edges. And then you're going to uh, take a little watermelon, diced up fresh watermelon. It's a great summer treat. Sprinkle that right there on top. Then you're going to take a little bit of feta cheese 
a little feta cheese right on top of that. You're gonna zest it just a little bit of lemon. A little zest of lemon. And top that with a little bit of mint. And you can stick a nice little serving tray. And that's also what we're gonna serve here for breakfast. And let me finish up the others. All right, we got the shishuka out and we're going to uh, put a little more salt and pepper on top of that. Get that onto the eggs. Paprika. And a little flat leaf parsley. And get that on there, it's a beautiful dish. And so we're gonna go ahead and serve. that on your plate and you can put a uh, dollop of Greek yogurt just kind of either the side or on top whichever you prefer with a little bit of a uh, crushed red pepper right on top and there you go so enjoy your breakfast and your brunch and look forward to seeing you guys on the next cooking with your agent